Yo, yo, what's happening? You alright, Owa? Oh god, the game's gone. Does Resident Evil always do this? Does Resident Evil always do this to me? There we are. It's back anyway. It's back anyway. How are we doing? We alright? Happy Big Tuesday. Happy Big Tuesday. Two days into the week. Look at that as well. We've already got a bot. We've got a bot to start. What a way to start. How do I... Uh, hold on. How do I get rid of that? I can't remember. What a way to start. Gross. A bot. A bot, a bot to begin with. Can I report this guy? Oh, hold on. No, that's reply. Shambles. Absolute shambles. I need to start this off. Ah, I remember. Right. Um, report. Spam, scams, or bots. Bot. There we are. Um, there we go. Submit report. Okay, cool. And block them. Uh, can I get rid of that message? It can stay there. It can stay there. I don't know how to get rid of it. Uh, maybe someone else will, uh, will know when they show up. Anyway, anyway, anyway. Hello, hello, let's start again, shall we? Stupid bots, stupid bots. Uh, showing up yeah, immediately, straight away in, in the chat. How are we doing anyway? How are we doing? Um, happy Big Tuesday to you. Happy Big Tuesday, everyone. Um, now, bear with me one moment, one moment. I just wanna see how th things, uh, things sound a second. Okay, okay, you can hear me at least. You can hear me at least. Um, it seems like everything's uh, okay at the moment um hey so yes uh here we are back in resident evil 4 now um i did mention this yesterday um twitter i, I said it was going to be resident evil 2 remake but i rethought that uh because last week of course there was the um resident evil 4 remake uh reveal last week at the state of play on thursday and uh i thought you know it'd make more sense to do resident evil 4 and um, we still um, we still have professional difficulty to go because uh, we streamed this semi recently, um, even before uh, even before the announcement for the remake. I was saying, uh, uh, "Hey Magoop, hey worker lurk, thanks for the lurk, Magoop, thanks for the lurk, and happy Big Tuesday, Magoop, thanks for lurking, thank you very much, appreciate that." But um, yeah, way before way before the um, the announcement of uh, Resident Evil Four remake, I was like. I, I, almost, I was coming to uninstall Resident Evil 4 after we beat it, um, just to make some room on my computer. And uh, I was like, I noticed, I noticed that on Steam, the only achievement I don't have it, after playing through it is um, the one for beating it on Professional. Because uh, you need to beat it at least once to even unlock that difficulty. So that, I, that was even way before uh, the, the, the remake uh, reveal. And um, so I'm not following the hype or anything. It just like it's just the stars lined up for me. That's all. So uh, I know a lot of people have been uh, have been streaming this since then, and uh, I'm not just uh, jumping on the bandwagon, so to speak. Um, so uh, yeah, we're gonna go through. Uh, <laughs> now bear in mind, professionals, no joke. All right, it's no joke. Not from what I remember, anyway. And um, I that was way back in the day, mind. Way back in in 2005. Uh, but I I think that was the last time I I beat this game on professional professional difficulty. And um, it's no joke. It really isn't. It's quite a tough. It's quite a tall task. So it's uh, going to be um, a lot different to when we were last playing. Um, hopefully, it's still fresh in my mus muscle memory as well, this game. Hopefully, uh, at least. And um, it's going to be a lot of um, planning, a lot of uh, ammo uh, cons conserving. Um, we're going to have to be careful with um, what we carry, what we take. Uh, what ammo we decide to spend. Uh, we have to use the knife a lot more. Uh, there's going to be a trick to it where we have to uh, use the knife uh, quite a bit and um, save all of our um, powerful guns for tough bosses later on. Um, 
it's going to be a lot of trial of and error in some areas. Some areas are absolute nightmare. Some areas will be um, an absolute nightmare, and there'll be uh, uh, a lot of trial and error and, and strategizing. So um, this is going to take a while. This is going to take a few parts. I'm going to have to figure out where to slot this in uh, to my schedule moving forward. Uh, I guess we'll we'll figure it out after tomorrow. We'll see how Pokemon goes tomorrow and see if uh, you guys want me to carry on with that. Um, hopefully, because um, last week Pokemon was hella fun and um, you guys seem to enjoy it as well. So um, I'm going to try and figure something out with my schedule. Maybe even uh, add an extra stream in every week. Uh, but yeah, um, that said, uh, that said, let's get straight into it, shall we? As you can see, I'm on the title screen here. There's a lot of uh, new stuff. Um, there's a lot of new stuff on the, uh, on the title screen here. Um, extras, you've got the mercenaries and, uh, whatever these are. Movie browser, um, I guess that's just cutscenes. Or, oh, I think I know what that might be. Hopefully there's, like, some live action stuff. Um, like, where they're doing mocap and stuff, that'd be funny. Hader's report, I guess that's, um, like the, uh, um, you know, you got that like written, um, they're like statements at the beginning of every, uh, uh, I think it was on separate ways or maybe assignment Ada. Um, it's probably just all of those written, uh, uh, reports that she makes. But anyway, we're going to go to new game and, uh, of course there it is unlocked, freshly unlocked professional. Now this isn't new game plus either. You can't do a new game plus when you pick professional. So we're going to be starting completely from scratch. We're not going to have any of our guns that we had or, or anything. None of our upgrades is totally from scratch. So uh, uh, let's do this, shall we? Resident Evil 4. Oh, I forgot all about this. Um, I can't remember which one's which. I don't want the... Uh, the gangster one. I want the RPD one. Which I think... Logically, the RPD one should be special one. Because um, I think the uh, other one was added later on. After the GameCube release. Let's try special one. And if it's not the right one, I'll restart. 1998. I'll never forget it. It was the year when those grisly murders occurred in the Arklay Mountains. Hopefully it's not Soon too loud after, either. The news was out to the whole world, revealing that it was the fault of a secret viral experiment conducted by the international pharmaceutical enterprise, Umbrella. The virus broke out in a nearby mountain community, Raccoon City, and hit the peaceful little town with a devastating blow. I think what I'll do... Foundation. Um, I think what I'll do is maybe Not taking any chances, turn it down a touch the president um, after the, the after the cut scene, contingency case. plan to sterilize records. If I remember, this one was um, this one was loud. With the whole affair loud. gone public, the United States government issued an indefinite suspension of business decree to Umbrella. Soon, its stock it is prices a crashed, game. and for all intents and purposes, Umbrella was finished. Six years have passed since that horrendous incident. I received special training via a secret organization working under the direct control of the president. I was to assume the responsibility of protecting the new president's family. Cornia, why am I the one who always gets the short end of the stick? Yo, who are you really? Oh, we got the right costume. Amazing. And it's in cutscenes. I don't remember it being in cutscenes before. You have my sympathies. Guess that's a local's way of breaking the ice. Anyway, you know what this is all about. My assignment is to search for the president's missing daughter. What? All by yourself? <laughs> I'm sure you boys didn't just tag along so we could sing Kumbaya together at some Boy Scout bonfire. Then again, maybe you did. Oh, you crazy American. It's a direct order from the chief himself. I tell you, it's no picnic. I'm counting on you guys. Hmm. 
It was right before I was to take on my duties of protecting the President's daughter when she was abducted. That's the ultimate reason I'm in this lonely and rural part of Europe. According to our intelligence, there's reliable information about a sighting of a girl that looks very similar to the President's daughter. Apparently, she's being withheld by some unidentified group of people. Who would have thought that my first job would have been a rescue mission? Ah, it's freezing. So cold all of a sudden. Ah, must be my imagination. Sorry it took so long. Just up ahead is the village. I'll go and have a look around. Yeah, we'll stay and watch that car. Don't want to get any parking tickets. Right. Parking tickets. Good luck. Jeez. Who are these guys? Did you say something? I hope you can hear me. I'm Ingrid Hunnigan. I'll be your support on this mission. Loud and clear. Somehow I thought you'd be a little older. So the subject's name's Ashley Graham, right? That's right. She's the daughter of the president. So try to behave yourself, okay? <laughs> Whoever this group is, they sure picked the wrong girl to kidnap. I'll try to find some more information on my end as well. Good. Talk to you later. Leon out. Cool. All right. Um, let me just uh, adjust the volume really quickly. Because um, I think I remember it being a bit loud last time we played. Uh, bear with. Um, I'm going to put it down. We'll put it there. And then um, we'll see how it goes. Um, if it's too loud or too quiet still. Um, if you can, just let me know. Now, uh, let's just uh, familiarize ourselves. That's the knife. X is... Uh, right, okay, gotcha. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, I'm not going to waste bullets on, on birds right now. Uh, we got the right costume as well, which is cool. This is the one I wanted, not the other one. We wanted to uh, take it back uh, to good old Resident Evil 2. Um, right, okay. All right, let's kick things off. Was there anything around here? Oh, there was. Dang, it didn't give me anything. Yeah, this is going to be a lot tougher <laughs> than last time. A lot tougher. So, uh, let's, uh, let's encounter this first guy. Nothing there. Cool. Uh, excuse me. Sir? Sir? Uh, sir? Hello, sir? Are you dead? I was wondering uh, he's if like you might recognize a girl in this photograph. Can't turn to the left. Or the right. <laughs> Sorry to have bothered <clears throat> Go, Leon! He's gonna get a weapon! So I'm a cop. Freeze. I said freeze. Sir, I'm a cop. Wrong button. It's down on the ground. Now we're gonna have to do this a lot. Save uh save our bullets. We have to knock them down to the ground. Find their weak point, get them down. Uh run up, melee them, and then knife them on the ground. Still a little too loud, maybe. Shit. 
Hold on. Maybe I'll uh, maybe I'll turn it down just a little bit just to be on the safe Is everything side. Okay? There was a hostile local. I had no choice but to neutralize him. There are still others surrounding the area. Get out of there and head toward the village. Take whatever measures he necessary to save the subject. Understood. Okay, bear with me. I'm gonna knock it down just a little tad more. Um then we should be fine. I can always put it back up if it's uh, if it's too quiet. Let me try that. We knock it down uh, five five points more. Right, okay. What's reload? There we go. Got it. Um, I can't remember if there's anything in this house now. I don't think there's anything upstairs. Some guys outside though. Ah, bullets. Oh yeah, I'll take the bullets. Right. Right, rather than just dive out there, let's see what we can do from here. Okay, I can't get a... Do I need to... Ah! Alright, there we go, now we can do it. Oh, he's coming in! Oh, come on. See, look at the damage. Get down on the ground. There we go. Bloody hell. We're already taking a big knock. It's only the beginning. I've got... What have I got on me? That's map. Right, I have got a first aid spray. At least. Cool. I might have to use this already, you know. We'll take it, we'll take it. A wooden box. A little wooden boy. Um, right. Where's, um, where's dog bro? Don't forget dog bro. Have I passed him? I don't think so. Oh, here's dog bro. Hey, dog bro. Let's help our little dog bro. Okay, cool. And off he goes. Right. There's booby traps here. You can already see them. So, uh, hopefully, hopefully I can get them to run into the booby traps here. Save some, uh, Save me some ammo. Okay, got his attention. Oh, this guy's genius. He went, he went through the middle. more than that. Oh, it's just him. Okay. All right. Okay, cool. Oh, another herb. Useful. Oh, do you know what I've been doing wrong? Do you know what I forgot to do? Wrong button. Probably going to be doing that a lot. Do you know what I've forgotten to do? Forgotten about my damage buff. There we go. That's better. It's pro tip, see? If you put your guns uh, upside down, they do more damage. They do 69% uh, more damage. Stop! Halt, sir! I'm a cop. Freeze! Yeah, that's, uh, that's a strat we're going to have to use quite a lot. 
to save bullets is uh, use the knife on them when they're on the ground. If they go. I don't think they uh, try and attack you just yet. I think it's okay to let them go. Anyone in there? There is. I've seen them. I've seen them with my own eyes. Um, sir? Sir, I'm a cop. Can you... Sir, come, come out with your hands up. Sir? There we go. Who said that? Yes, physio. What's up, dude? How are we doing? How's, uh, how's your day been, physio? Thanks for coming along, dude. Thanks for coming along. Um, if you can, physio, um, just, just let me know everything sounds okay. I've turned the uh, game down quite a bit. Because uh, if I remember last time, this game was pretty loud. But um, if it's too quiet, I'll put it back up again a bit. But uh, if you could, just let me know. And uh, sounds good. Okay, cool. Cool. Thanks, dude. How are you, man? You had a good day today, I hope. Happy Big Tuesday. Leon, how you holding up? Bad question, Honigan. Sorry to hear that. I'm sending you a playing manual. Hope you find it useful. I'll take Play a look in at manual. It. Thanks. It's fine. I, I think I know how to play. I'm, uh, I'm professional. I know how to play. Right. Uh, I'm good. Doing work. Was a good day, though. Cool. Glad you had a good day, bro. Glad you had a good day. Right, if you remember, last time we played, I was like, um, if you, I, you can't quite see it, it's that building there though, I believe. Um, I was like, if you go in there, you trigger Chainsaw Boy. I'm not going to do that this time, <laughs> for obvious reasons. I don't want to fight Chainsaw Boy on professional mode, so I'm not going to do it this time. We've got to be, um, we've got to try and be as efficient as we possibly can this, this time round. Because, uh, like I was saying earlier, professional is no joke. Please lay an egg. Please lay an egg, hen. Hey, little hen. When, when, when will you lay me an egg for my tea? Hey, little hen. When, when, when will you try to supply one for me? Are you going to lay an egg? It would be really helpful if you would lay me an egg, please. Mr. Chicken? Well, actually, you'd have to be a girl chicken, right? So, Mrs. Chicken, she didn't lay me an egg. How stingy. Food in. Um, I believe there's someone around this corner. I think they caught me last time, in fact. No? Okay. I think I could get in that house though. Chicken! Give me an egg, chicken! I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna stroll over here. Oh god, I've spotted. I've been spotted. I've been spotted. Run, chicken! <laughs> They're coming! Right, we're gonna 300 this and funnel them all down here. Oh, they're behind me. They're behind me. Oh, God. I think I'm dead. 100% dead. Uh, how about you? Uh, I thought the life upgrades carried over. No, you can't New Game Plus, um, professional. You have to start from scratch. You have to start from scratch. Unfortunately. That's why it's so difficult. Um, but yeah, I'm good. Thanks, bro. I'm good. Um, I was a little bit dead earlier. Um, I um, did. Uh, I, I usually this usually happens to me on a Monday, but um, I, uh, I I ended up ordering ordering food for dinner. I ordered a foot long subway and uh, a couple of uh, extras as well. And uh, after that, um, I had a little nap because I felt really tired, and uh, I fell asleep about. I fell asleep for about an hour, and then um, for about half an hour then, I was like, oh, I, I should get up, I should get, you know, that when you're like 
trying to like wake up, but you're like, oh, in a minute, in a minute. So I got up about, um, I'm going to use this one. I'm going to use this one because I've got two in my inventory. So uh, I got up about half an hour after that and I felt dead. Um, I forgot to open my window after streaming yesterday as well. So it was like super warm in my room. And uh, yeah, I felt dead and uh, really, really warm as well. Um, it's going to be warm today as well because I haven't bothered opening the window for obvious reasons. Um, the seagulls are just, it's just no point, you know? So uh, I had a shower and uh, I feel a bit better now. I still feel uh, quite full though. And uh, I had a shower. I had a cold shower as well to cool down. And uh, it's all good now. It's all good. I'm uh, bright eyed and bushy tailed. Still got a full belly though. And uh, get down. Yeah, there you go. Uh, still got a full belly, uh, but I'm, uh, I'm good. I'm good. Long story short, I'm good. <laughs> but uh, I felt a bit dead earlier after that. The nap made me feel um, worse at first. Uh, but I'm okay now. Oh god. Bad reload! Oh shit. No, that's not what I need. Oh god. Right, let's get out of here. Get off me and hand me. I'm a cop. That was the worst time to reload. Oh my god, terrible shooting. Fuck you all. Oh, oh. He's got a straw hat. Oh shit. They got reinforcements. Sir? Right, reload. Oh god, they're still alive. Oh god! Right. Jesus Christ. Okay. Oh. Right, I cannot get hit now. One more hit and I'm dead. Ma'am? This is not going well. Uh, I forgot that, damn. Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, it's tricky. It's tricky. And I'm not doing very well, and we're right at the beginning of the game. Okay, we can, uh, let's skip past this. I don't know why I'm doing this every time. You don't really need to do it. It's just uh, a cool little thing you can do at the beginning there. Right, I know that there's a herb here now. I'll use this. Just like last time. Uh, being as a stingy hen won't lay an egg for me. Okay, they spotted me. Maybe I can hold my ground in here. Ooh! Okay, I'll take that. Should have just run out there and knifed her. That was um, that was a bad uh, a bad call. That was. I used too many bullets. Ow. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Not good. I guess we keep moving. Um, shit. Don't go in there. That's the uh, building that activates the chainsaw man. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. Let's quickly use. Uh, let's use this. Oh, they're behind me. Shit. Crap. 
Please lay an egg, chicken. I need eggs. Oh, God damn that guy up there. Oh, fuck. I'm dead. Hmm. All right. This time. This time. Okay. You! Ah, you git! Whoa! Ah. Bloody hell! Right, I gotta get from... Away from those guys on the roof. Oh, bad reload. I'm dead. Right. I might need to go in there, you know. I might need to go in that house because um, the shotgun's in there. Be a lot more useful than uh, this handgun will. Ma'am? Quick. You laid an egg! Finally! The lucky egg. I've got an egg now, you've got no chance. Right, I gotta reload. Watch out, guy on the roof. Right, this is going to be the trick, is just keep moving. I can't do the old uh, knife on the ground trick though, there's too many of them. Whoa! Oh, I was hoping he would get stunned so I could kick him. Damn it. I didn't want his head to blow up. Here we go. Okay, more of them. Whoa! Bastard! Right, use this first aid. And run. Oh shit, okay, alright. Um, I've cornered myself, that's not good. Uh oh. Get on my way. Get on my way, sir. I'm a cop. What's this? Aha! 
Okay, this is going to be handy. Why can I cook? That was lucky. I couldn't melee. Right, stay right. No, that's not enough of them. That's not enough of them. That'd be a waste. I'm empty. Are you kidding me? Oh, now I get a redhead. All right. Okay. Cool. Cool. Ooh, another lucky egg though. Um. I need ammo. <laughs> oh, I really need ammo. Oh, oh, okay. It's on a timer. It's fine. Uh, off you. Uh, if you if you knife the legs, does it make them stumble? Um, I don't think so. I don't think so. I think you might be able to get them to. Um, I don't know, actually. I don't know. You might have a point. You might have a point. Um, maybe you can with a knife. I can't really going? remember. Bingo. Man, that was much more difficult than I was anticipating, actually. This is going to get interesting. And I totally forgot as well. It's on a timer. If I'd have known that, Anakin, I, have some bad news. I would have just run around for a while. The body of an officer. Something's happened to the people here. Leon, you need to get out of there. Look for a tower and follow the trail near it. Got it. Okay. Now, um, now we're, we can uh, look around freely now, at least. Oh, also, uh, let's mix some of these. It was the lucky eggs, it was. Lucky eggs got me through that. Uh, I really badly need ammo as well. But um, I can go in here... Freely now, without uh, any trouble. So that's good. <clears throat> oh, bullets. Amazing. Uh, we got at least one clip. That's cool. And, uh, and we're on full health. We're actually in really good shape. We're in really good shape. I'm on full health. I've got a... Um, mixed herb. Two lucky eggs. A shotgun. We're in good shape again now. Uh, before I forget, though, um, this is very important, obviously. Do that for bonus damage. Be neat as well. You know what I'm like. Right, okay, cool. Yeah, we're in really, really good shape now. Cool. I thought I would have had to um, use the bullet to pick that up, but and I was going to be like, I'm not using the bullet. I'd rather uh, I'd rather keep the bullet than get the treasure. <clears throat> yeah, there's a prime. That was a prime example of what I was saying earlier as well. A lot of this, uh, a lot of this is going to be trial and error. Is it is going to be rather tricky, especially in some bits. Some bits are an absolute nightmare on this difficulty. There's um, in the castle. Is that room um, with stairs? It goes uh, this uh, like stairs going upwards. It's like a corridor, and there's two of those claw blind claw guys. That room, oh my god, that room is an absolute nightmare. Those claw guys, in just in general, are going to be horrible. Plenty of shotgun, though. That's cool. I'm going to have to uh, keep shotgun, though, for emergencies. It's going to be my cloud, uh, crowd clearer. Because uh, I, got, I got seriously swarmed and overwhelmed uh, a lot then, back then. So uh, that's going to have to be uh, used for crowd control, I think. That could get me in a good position to just knife people on the floor then as well. Ooh, nice. Excellent, okay. Now we got a fully mixed herb. Brilliant. Okay, I think we got everything in this area, if I'm not mistaken. I'm just going to check around this corner. I think I got the box, though. 
I did. Okay, cool. Yeah, I think that's everything. Everything we can pick up for the time being. Um, and uh, I believe... I believe we go this way. Nope. Um, this way. Give me all our monies. This game is so good. It really is. Last time, uh, last time I played through it, I was like, oh my god. It's, I, I, it's so good to play this game again. So it's been a, a long time. But uh, it, really, it really is great. It really is great. It really is a great game. Excuse me. Okay, all right. Now, um, the thing is, right, it's debatable whether or not it's worth getting these uh, med blue medallions. It's going to cost me bullets. But then again, I can sell the gun. Because uh, we didn't end up using it last time. Um, I forget who said, so apologies, but um, I was told, and it did serve me really well as well. I was told that the Red 9 is the best gun, the best handgun. And it did serve me extremely well last time. So I might go for that again. When, it's, when they're on their own, one by one, you've got to use this knife, uh, knife technique. You saw how quickly I ran out of bullets last time, uh, earlier. Okay, I think, uh, I think we're good now. I, think, I don't think anyone else has noticed me. How are we looking for bullets? Right, we've got a few. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start getting these. I mean, why not, right? These are the sorts of decisions that we're going to have to make now. Is uh, whether or not it's worth a bullet, essentially. Let's go and take out this guy. We will get them, I think. I think we will get them, because then we can sell the gun anyway. Make some money. You know? Makes sense. I just gotta make sure I don't miss. Ooh, we got another egg as well. Awesome. Oh! I heard someone. I'm scared. Alright, 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 it's fine. Be cool. Sit down. Oh, you can! You Physio, you can stun him with a knife. Awesome. But that was in the head, though. Why did I do that? Why did I shoot him on the ground? That was dumb. Did I pick up the egg? I missed the egg! It disappeared! Oh, no! That ain't fair. Yeah, I hit him in the head to stun him with a knife. So that's good to know. Come out here. Put your hands up. Come out here with your hands up. I'm a cop. Oh. He's got a knife. Don't you dare say that. Cool. It's 
all money, man. Give me, uh, give me a bit of ammo as well. Gonna need ammo. Right. Ah, speak of the devil. Good shit. Okay. Oh, flip. Oh, come on. I haven't got the bullets to waste. There we go. There's not all of them in this area, though. There's definitely more. I think there's one... There's one up there. Possibly on the other side as well. I can't remember if I got that one. Uh, there's one... There. I'm gonna miss my chance now, and I. There we go. Got it. Oh, and there's another one up there. I just spotted. I was just about to say it's probably easier to hit that one from the ground, but that's fine. It worked out. Okay. Got the beer stein. Right, let's go and uh, check for those uh, medallions up here. I think, I think there's, uh, th th there's one up here and possibly one behind it as well. Yeah. One over the other side, possibly. Come on, Leon. S steady your aim, Leon. There we go. Ooh, an egg! Fantastic. I hope, um, I hope that one that disappeared earlier, I hope it wasn't like a good one, like a golden one. I don't think it would be, but there's, there's a chance it could be. Right, I think I got all the medallions in this area now. Um, before I forget, before I forget though, let's get up here. Oh, shotgun. Nice. Uh, now, this door is locked. Yeah, this door is locked. Just wanted to get the, uh, get the box. And I'm pretty sure we got all the medallions. I don't have the map yet with all the locations. But I'm pretty sure, uh, pretty sure that was all of them. Okay. Um, yeah, okay. I think we're good. I think we're good. Let's go. Oh, is this the boulder? I think this is the boulder. Yep. Cool. All right. Uh, now, do I want... Yeah, I want these treasures. This bit could be tricky. Sir, drop your weapon. Oh, God. That's the way I was aiming. But I hit him in the head. That's funny. There we go. Nice, too. Nice. Cool. All right. It's good shit. What's got Leon so spooked? Do you see him like turning around then? It's those bats, isn't there? The bats have got him spooked. Whoa. Okay. All right. I see him. Of 
god, where is where's that come from? Right, I've got to be really careful now. So it's still inside. Nice. All right, that worked out. Give me those before they uh, disappear. Ooh, a grenade. Nice. Give me two of those. Right, there's treasure in this tree. Cool. That's important treasure as well. Ah, I waved. Um, I think that's everything here. I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Be careful as well, there's bear traps around. There's nothing in the trees to my memory, so let's go. I don't think there's any more enemies either, to be fair. We're in, uh, we're in really good shape. Really, really good shape. This is the end of the chapter now as well. Um, let me just, uh, let me just sort out this stuff. Gotta be neat. Can't help it. There you go. That'll do for the time being. Um, now don't walk into that. That will blow you up. Oh, there's another one. Money. Ooh. Take that. Oh, yeah. Uh, wrong button. It's weird to me, man, that um, Y button is map and star is menu. Uh, to my mind, this should be the other way around. Y should be menu and start should be map. So I keep pressing the map button all the time. Okay, cool. Hey, Lewis. Ah, a little rough, don't you think? You're not like them? No. You? Oh, shit. You're a new rival. Thanks for the raid, buddy. Mini raid, but still, haha. <laughs> no, I'll take it, new rival. Thank you very much. How you doing, man? How you doing? Sorry, the music's gonna go on for some time. It's gonna go on for quite some time. Thank you so much, uh, your new rival. Appreciate the raid. And uh, welcome raiders as well. Welcome raiders. No problem, on my guy. Not too bad, huh? Just getting back into streaming again the last day or two. Okay, cool, man. Cool. I'm sorry about the music. It goes on for quite some time. <laughs> what is he? <laughs> Go on, go on, rival. Get down up here. Get down up here. Yeah, man. Um, it's uh, it's good to hear from you, rival. Cause um, okay, I can't really uh, I don't really gonna bump into you uh, in the office anymore. So it's good, to, it's good to hear from you. I'm glad you're well as well, dude. Glad you're well. When uh, when the music calms down. When the guards go back to patrolling. Ah, oh, there they go. There they go. Oh, Remy Haha. -ha. Thank you for the follow. Thank you so much, Remy Haha. -ha. And welcome, readers. Um, I'm, uh, I'm Andy, uh, also known as Mecca. And um, we're streaming today uh, Resident Evil 4 on professional difficulty because of, uh, in hype, because of the Resident Evil 4 remake uh, reveal last week. I've played this semi recently, 
uh, semi recently so um, I've got professional unlocked because you need to beat the game first before you can uh, try professional mode um, it's the hardest difficulty in the game and um, I've been murked four times right at the beginning of the game already <laughs> as you can see their number of times killed four but um, I, uh, I've got my muscle memory back now, I think. And uh, we're doing okay. We're in good shape. And uh, Remy Haha. Hi, hi. Came from Rival Stream. Uh, thank you. Uh, thank you, Remy, for the follow. I really appreciate that. And thank you, Rival, once again. Just in case you couldn't hear me talk from the guards. Uh, they've, they've gone back to patrolling now anyway. Don't worry. Uh, but thanks for, the, uh, thanks for the raid. And welcome, raiders, as well. Welcome to Mecha May Fly. Um, we're playing Resident Evil today, but I generally play like lots of different things. Um, at the moment, lately, we've been playing um, Skyrim. Skyrim's been a, an ongoing thing for a while, um, and probably will be. It'll probably be. Uh, I'll be pr probably be playing that game for the rest of my life, to be honest. And um, we're playing El Elden Ring still. And uh, I started uh, Pokemon Legends last week as well, which was really fun. Which was really really fun. But welcome, welcome to uh, welcome to. Uh, the show i guess i hope you enjoy yourself i hope you enjoy yourself and uh thank you once again rival and uh thank you uh thank you once again remy as well rival um i'll say it again just in case uh i got drowned out by the uh the raid music but um it's good to hear from you dude because um i'm not likely to bump into you as much irl anymore but um <laughs> it's it's really good to hear from you i'm glad you're doing well as well buddy i'm glad you're doing really well but yeah Oh my god, thank you very much. Thank you very much indeed. Right, I'm definitely saving. I'm uh, taking every opportunity I can to save. Uh, at the end of chapters, that is. Because uh, we, we got murked. We got murked uh, four times. Four Feeble times in total. Humans. Let us give you uh, <laughs> You're more than welcome, my guy. True, true. Are you coming back to Admiral? Last I heard, you had a six-month career break or something. Um, I actually left. Yeah, I, I actually left in the end. I left at the beginning of April. So, no, I'm not coming back. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. And it's, I guess it's okay to say that now. Um, it was a bit uh, funny at the beginning. It was a bit, like, too soon sort of thing. But no, I'm uh, I'm gone. I'm gone, my dude. Uh, Remy, gonna be in and out. Gotta get some hey. foods. Have hey, good stream in the meantime. Thank you, Remy. And uh, I hope you're uh, having yeah. some delicious food as well. Hope it's something real good. All out of one hole and into another. Uh, fair. Sorry to see you go, man. I'll definitely here. keep in touch here. Yeah, definitely, man. Definitely. That will be nice. That will be nice. Now what but yeah, it's good to hear from you, rival. To good to hear from you. Oh, hey, easy. Whoever you are. Hold on, there's going to be a QT coming up now, so I just got to keep my uh, ears Fear. sealed. But, uh, but thanks, guys. Thanks, guys. Or something? Nah, you don't look the type. Maybe. What do you mean I don't look like a cop? Have you not seen my my outfit? Okay, let me guess. I got an RPD She's outfit the on. President's daughter. <laughs> That's too good for a guess. Thanks for the Let's look, rival. Explaining. Psychic powers. Have some, uh, have some good eats, guys. Have something uh, delicious to eat. With you, amigo. I overheard one of the villagers talking something about the president's daughter. This bit's gonna be hella tricky as well, isn't it? I remember this bit. We're gonna need the rifle for this bit. I hope I got. Oh, I should have the money for it. And who might you be? Me llamo Luis Serra. I used to be a cop in Madrid. But now I'm just a good-for-nothing guy who happens to be quite the ladies' man. Why'd you quit? <laughs> I like Lewis. Lewis is cool. You, put your life on the line. you see him briefly Nobody in the new trailer, right? He sounds effort. a lot different. They've obviously got a Being different a voice actor for him this time around. You see him briefly, and he's holding up the uh, Red Just 9 as well. Myself. Only for a day, though. I think I'm going to stick I with that I gun this playthrough, because it served me well last so time. I, managed to get myself involved with the incident I was told it's the best handgun, so uh, I'll trust that. That is the incident with the viral outbreak, right? I think I might have seen a I'll trust that advice. And it did park. serve me well. Here we go. QTE time. I believe it's triggers. After you. Nope! It wasn't triggers. They uh they mix it up. They mix it up. It's different every time. <laughs> Is it
It's Leon. I wonder if it's fun. I wonder if they're going to keep Hunnigan in the new one. Because to me, um, I, I didn't think this initially, but um, I can't remember who mentioned it now. So someone in a YouTube video I watched afterwards. But um, they show Leon in the car um, in the new trailer, and he's looking at the photo of Ashley, and he's talking about um, wanting to forget about that night and the pain. Um, I wonder if, like, I wonder if he's not been sent uh, to save Ashley in the new version, because they're, they're going to alter the story. I think they've already confirmed that they're going to alter the story a little, and it's going gonna, it's gonna to be a lot more, like, grounded and darker, I think. I wonder if he's actually uh, following Ashley because uh, he was supposed to be taking care of her uh, when she got kidnapped and, she, and he fucked up. And that's the night he's referring to, you know, uh, maybe he's, uh, yeah, he's chasing after her because he, he failed to uh, protect her or something. Got something Where in, the, in this one, you get the feeling that he's been sent in by the president to, to go and rescue her, you know. Got a selection of good things on sale. I uh, don't know if you noticed, Stranger, but did you uh, see the blue medallions hanging around in the village? Uh, come back after you've shot ten or more of them. Uh, I've got a specialized gun I want you to try out. Okay, cool. What are you selling? Uh, first things first. Let's sell uh, these. Is that all? Uh, this. <laughs> don't sell them. They combine. Um, so we're not selling them just yet. Right. Um, I need to buy. Buying? Not upgrades. I need... Buying? Oh, I need lots of stuff. Um, lots of stuff, and I'm not going to be able to afford everything that I want. Uh, let's see. We definitely need the rifle. Okay. Is that all? Uh, hmm. Okay. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. First things first. The attache Is case. <laughs> there Thank we go. you. Uh, now we get the rifle. Oh, can I afford the rifle and scope, though? Because I need them both. I can. Can I? I can't. I can't. I can't afford them both. Shit. Um, what are you selling? Oh, no, that's not good. That is definitely not good. I'm going to have to sell my eggs. If I sell two of these... Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. What are you buying? Is that all? Right, I'll um, I'll tidy up my attaché and just... Oh, I can do it now. Okay. Uh, right. Let's be neat. Neat and tidy. Uh, put my egg over there as well. Right. Um... Right. Move them out of the way a second. Sorry, I've got like OCD. Um, <laughs> I need to, I need everything to be uh, neat um, in my attaché. It's an uh, issue I've got, and uh, I acknowledge it. That's the first step, right? Right. And uh, in case you're wondering why I've got my uh, weapons upside down as well, uh, that actually gives you a damage buff. It gives you 69% da extra damage on your weapons. We'll put the scope upside down as well. That's absolutely true as well. I'm not making that up in the slightest. <laughs> Thank you. Um, right. Okay. What we're going to need to be um, conscious of this time as well. It wasn't so important last time because uh, we weren't on professional. I'm going to have to make sure that when I'm buying um, ammo upgrades for my weapons, when I'm upgrading my weapons, I'm going to make sure that they're not full to make the most of it because that'll... Uh, That'll then refill the clip. If you upgrade the ammo, uh, it fills uh, it fills your gun back up as well. Oh, also, before I forget, combine them. Okay. Okay, Mr. Rifle. Time to shine. This bit's gonna be this bit's gonna be quite tricky. It's gonna be quite tricky indeed. Right. Um 
Get some of these long distance ones, I guess. Don't you move. Stay still. Okay, never mind. He's staying still. Oh no. Did that kill him? He lived! Make sure I hit him in the head then. Right, two shots left. I think I've got more ammo actually. I think I've got a, full, uh, a reload for it. So it's fine. More than two. Cool. We got it. All right, forget that. Do you know what um, else this game could benefit from? Well, I guess uh, any anything I say like that is going to be uh, null and void now, right? Because they are remastering the game. So uh, there's no point in going like, oh, oh they, if only they changed the tank controls, if only they uh, updated this, because they are going to re... Oh, shit, wrong button. What a waste. They are remastering it, so it's null and void saying anything like that. But anyway, do you know what it could benefit from? It could benefit from a um, quick select. Like uh, mapping your guns to like the D-pad, for instance. Uh, that would be cool, you know? But uh, like I say, there's no point in saying stuff like that anymore. They are remastering the game after all. Or remaking it, sorry. I think this version is technically a remaster. I don't know though. I don't know if it counts as a remaster. Oh! Some of these guys got bombs. Uh, nice! Alright, that actually worked in my favour. More of them have got bombs, be careful. He just killed his homie, and, and I think he killed himself as well. What a dumbass. I ain't complaining though, I'll take it. Oh, I can't reach. That's annoying. Stop, halt, I'm a cop. I saw that. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, back up, back up. Get out of here. Oh, he went down, he went down. That's cool. They, um... That's interesting. That happened again. They don't quite throw it all the way up here to me. And, uh, it kind of, like, bounces back and kills them. That's cool. It's worth knowing. Right. Right, let's go on the loot now. Pick up everything that isn't nailed down. Oh shit. Alright. Oh! Oh, that was, that was a mistake. Okay. I think that was worth it in that instance. I'm gonna... Do I want to use my lucky egg? I think I should. I think I should. I'm gonna lose my luck buff now though. Knife. Get a knife on him. There, okay, I got a knife. I'm a cop. Oh, hey. I only just noticed this guy. I got a knife. Oh, yeah. There, um, I'm gonna try and refrain from using flash grenades right now. Uh, they're going to be really useful later on, see, uh, when they start having uh, head guys, when the he they have the, uh, the parasites pop out their heads. Uh, they're really useful for those enemies because uh, they insta-kill them, 
So I'm gonna try and oh god, I'm gonna try and refrain from using any flash bombs just yet. Not until later, anyway. Oh god, I'm right up in his grill. Use my north. Cut his ankles. I mean, that would work, right? If you cut his uh, Achilles tendon, that would totally work. He wouldn't be able to walk. That would absolutely 100% work. I don't know. Uh, I don't know about killing him, but it would definitely immobilise him. Right. Uh, shall I use my rifle? I guess so, right? It's a good time to use my rifle. Get that guy. Can't believe he didn't die. He's definitely dead now, though. Can't see any others? Okay. Might want to reload. Wrong button. I gotta stop doing that. Ammo is precious. Uh, I think the other bit is up this way. I can't remember as well if this uh, this just keeps going until you pick up both bits. Or whether there's like a finite amount of enemies here. Can't remember. There we go. Now we got both bits anyway. And uh Oh nope, here they come. Hard reload! Right. Get out of here. Okay. I don't know if they left any uh any boxes up there. I'm gonna use up uh this. Oh, I haven't got my gun equipped. Genius. He didn't die from that? Come on. Oh, whoa. Oh, he's dro <laughs> dropped his weapon as well. Nice. Are they dead? They're not dead. Cool. Awesome. I think we got two fully mixed herbs now. We have. Sick. All right, cool. Oh! Get out of my house! Oh, no. Right, I didn't want his head to pop. I wanted to kick him. Wow. Okay, okay. All right. Now it's time to use one of these because um, it's going to upgrade our max health as well. So I may as well. All right. All right, that was, uh, that was close. That was close. I actually nearly died from that. Actually nearly died. Oh, I didn't spot him either. Reload. That was really close. 
literally almost died. Right, okay. Down on the ground. Okay. Right, now's the time. Now's the time. Shock in time. Oh, he's ducked! Mother liquor! Oh, that's it! Thank goodness for that! Right, cool. Woo! We're in the clear. Nice. Also, I didn't leave anything up here either. That's cool. Wow! All right, okay. We got everything in here? No. Ooh, monies. I'll take that. Ooh. Transform and roll out. Crowbrew, thank you very much for the lurk, Crowbrew. I really appreciate that. Thanks a lot. Everyone's feeling, everyone's feeling really generous today and following. I do appreciate it. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Ooh. Oh, yeah, I'll take bullets. I'll take bullets all day long. Right, okay. Alright, let's move out of here. We've got both bits for the door, so let's go. Uh, do you combine them first? Yeah, you do. Yeah, thank you, uh, thank you very much for the follows today, guys. Really appreciate that. Oh, is this the bit... Yeah, this is the bit where you got to, like, um, duck from the dynamite and the... Shit, alright, okay, okay. That's fine, that's fine. Also, um, I didn't buy a treasure map. Don't think I have, but um, I really hope I haven't missed any treasures. There's definitely, um, there's definitely something, uh, a good treasure in this place. Uh, but it's, it's well hidden as well. Uh, but it's fine, it's fine. I'll, uh, I'll remember how to get it, I'll figure it out. Right, okay. There it is, there it is. But you can't just go through there. You have to go around uh, an awkward way. But uh, I can't leave without that. I've got to make sure I get it. Right, okay. All right. Before I go in and start the madness, though, um, I'm sorry to do this. Uh, Crowbrew, yo, man, how goes Resi 4? Just caught the tail end of Rival Stream and been lurking. Saw so you are doing this on big, hard difficulty. Yeah, um, it's going okay-ish so far it started off really bad it got murked like four times in the beginning area um but um the reason why we're playing it is um obviously because of the uh, the remake trailer that they dropped last week uh but i s played through this semi recently because obviously you have to beat the game uh to unlock even unlock professional difficulty and uh, i've done professional way back in the day um i did it way back in the day when i played i played the hell out of this game back on the gamecube when it came out um, I played it to death, and I, I did it then. But um, I uh, I was I was uninstalling the game after beating it, or I was going to at least. And then I noticed on Steam um, after playing through it on stream, um, the only thing I had left in the achievements list was to beat it on professional. So even before the trailer dropped, I was like, oh, we'll we'll beat it on professional. We may as well um, because. Uh, it's the last thing to do, and then I've done everything. But um, then the trailer dropped, and I was like, "Oh my god, I'm playing playing Resident Evil 4. I'm playing Resident Evil 4. We're doing it." Um, so yeah, that, that's why, because because uh, the hype from the the remake trailer that dropped last week. Um, and uh, so far, um, we're in good shape. I had a really rough start though, really really rough start. And like I said, I died like four times in the first area. But um, I think my muscle memories come back to me now, and uh, we're doing good. Uh, I've skipped the trailer so far. But I'm pumped. Love the 2 Remake. The 2 Remake was really good, um, Crowbrew. The 2 Remake was really good. And um, I'm happy that it was really good as well. Because um, number 2 was actually my favourite, the original one. Um, I played that a lot back in the day on PS1. And uh, I, I knew that game inside out. So I was really, really uh, happy with the, uh, uh, the 2 Remake. I've played that on the channel as well. I almost played that today. But I was like, um, I, you know, Resident Evil 4 is more fresh in my muscle memory. And um, it's more on, on topic as well because of the trailer drop-in. 
But um, I'll definitely be playing Remake 2 again in the near future. Absolutely, 100%. But um, if you give me just a moment, I'm sorry to do this. I won't be a sec, okay? I'll be just one moment. I'll be RB. Um, won't be long at all. Sorry. Two seconds. Hey oh, sorry about that guys. Magoop, how dare? <laughs> yeah, you're right. I can't even argue. <laughs> uh Crowbrew, uh, amazing. I've only really got into Resi with Resi 8. Uh when, then went back and played one and two. Such good atmosphere in the games. Um yeah, um I I mean they uh they still hold up as well. Especially um I don't know what versions you played. Um you've obviously played uh two remake. Um, I'm assuming you've probably played, uh, correct me if I'm wrong though, but I'm assuming you probably played um, the remade version of number one as well, because it's, kind of, uh, it's kind of hard to get, um, get hold of the original nowadays, unless you've got it already uh, installed in something like uh, PlayStation 3, for example. Um, sorry, Resi 7 was the one I started with. Okay, uh, I did not, the super old one. Oh, so you played the original, the original, original number one. Um, if, um, if you enjoyed that, I highly recommend you play the remake. The remake is superb. It even uh, holds up to the, this uh, today. It, it still uh, holds up uh, the test of time to today, really. Um, it's still a, a really, really good game. It's, um, it's still tank controls, um, fixed uh, camera angles, pre-rendered backgrounds, but it's, it's still such a good game. If you enjoyed the original original, then uh, you'll you'll love the remake. Uh, the only one to avoid really is number six. Number six is awful. The rest of them uh, are okay. Uh, the rest of them are okay to absolutely brilliant. You know. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry. Um, I don't really want to be. Oh god, I'm out of ammo. Shit. I thought that was going to hit me. Stop throwing things. You'll have someone's eye out. Cool. Oh, don't... Oh, I've only got two bullets left for my handgun. Oh, there we go. There we go. Thank goodness. I was going to say, that's, uh, that could be an issue. Um, also, let's reload my shotgun. That's not my shotgun. Reload my shotgun before I forget. Uh, the remake was the one I played. I didn't. Uh, I didn't word that super clearly. I'd love to try the old one though. I really love it. Did a Jill playthrough. Uh, she is best girl. She is best girl. Jill Valentine is best girl. Um, she she shows up as uh, the protagonist in uh, a couple more as well. She shows up in. Pardon me a second. Sorry. <laughs> um, yeah, she shows up in uh, number three. She's a protagonist in number three. And she shows up in... She shows up in... Oh, I, I won't say that, actually. That's a spoiler. She's not the protagonist in that game. Uh, but she plays as... Uh, uh, you can play as her in the DLC in, what, in, in said game. But I won't mention because it's kind of a spoiler. Um, and she shows up in Revelations 1 as well. I, I wasn't really that fond of the Revelations game. I haven't played number two, but uh, I played number one. I wasn't really that fond of it, to be honest with you. People do say it's pretty good, but I, I don't know. I don't know. I wasn't a fan of it, personally. Back at you. Oh, God. I think that's going to miss him. Nope, we got him. Cool. Cool. All right, we're good. Okay. Uh, there's bear traps here as well, mind. Can I knife these? I don't want to waste bullets on them. 
I can knife them. Brilliant. Okay. There's going to be more. If I remember from last time as well, they don't set these off, which is uh, kind of cheap. Um, I was just about to say, sorry, I forgot about seven. Oh, shit. Um, I have played it, but I haven't beat it. And I really liked uh, what I did play, though. I really, really liked what I played of uh, number seven. Um, personally, though, I prefer... Um, I don't know whether this is just... Oh, that was a lot of bullets I just, uh, I just threw away there. Um, I don't know whether this is just nostalgia, really, and because I grew up um, with uh, the older ones. But I do prefer the old style, where it's in uh, third person, uh, as opposed to the newer first person ones. The new ones are great, don't get me wrong. Shit, that was close. Um, they are really great, don't get me wrong, but I just prefer, I just prefer the old style, you know? But uh, Seven's really good. I gotta get around to beating it one day. What am I doing? I should have used my knife. God damn it. I gotta concentrate. I gotta concentrate on what I'm doing. Now I'm out of handgun bullets. Um, yeah, it's... Uh, I forgot what I was saying. Yeah, I prefer the older older versions, though. Uh, the older style, sorry. That's what I should say. Um, honestly, the atmosphere is super different between the FPS and third person. I love bo both styles, too. Have you played number eight? Have you played uh, Village? Because uh, Village is... An Nowhere near as terrifying as seven. Um, it's it's nowhere. It's it's got scary moments, but seven is just it's seven's probably, in my opinion, seven is probably the scariest in the entire series. If you ask me, it's terrifying. That game is absolutely terrifying. It's so tense, and uh, when you the bits where Jack Baker's just roaming around looking for you, it's like it's proper brown trousers time. That game is the most terrifying one in the series, if you ask me. That's including all the old ones as well. Um, there's a way of getting that mask. Um, let me try and remember how to get it now. We don't want to leave this house with, without getting it. Ooh, um, shall I use that? I mean, I'm, oh, every time I use the map, map button. I mean, I'm pretty, pretty much swimming in, uh, in herbs at the minute, so yeah, let's use it. Right, um, let's just try to remember how to get to this. Ah, there we go, simple enough. Um, where were we? Uh, I've been working on my way through eight. I'm not very far though. It's pretty good. Um, if you ask me though, it's too long. Um, it's too long. I won't spoil any of it for you if you're, if you're playing through it at the moment. But there's a moment, um, in my opinion, there's a moment where it should have ended, but it doesn't. It carries on a little bit, a little bit further, and it, it goes on too long, if you ask me. But other than that, it's really good. It's really good. I did enjoy number eight. Number eight, incidentally, as well, um, it's got a lot of number four vibes. Um, the location uh, and things like that, it just gives off uh, a lot of uh, Resident Evil 4 vibes. Uh, seven was so hard for me to play at times. It's super scary with oppressive atmosphere. I agree. I agree. When um when I did play through it, um I got to. I got to just after um, just after you know you play through um you pick up VHS tapes, and uh, they're like sections that you play through. I played through a bit where you have to like um you have to play you have to escape this room, and it's like a saw scenario. Um, I think you end up getting burnt to death at the end of it though. And then um, when you go back to being Ethan Winters, then um, you're, um, I, I was basically going uh, up against a bunch of traps that the sun had laid, laid out. Um, that's, where I, that's where I was. Um, and I really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it. I'm going to have to beat it one day. Um, I can probably do that on stream in the near future. And uh, I really need handgun ammo. I can't keep using this shotgun. It's, uh, it's a bit of a waste. Um, also... Uh, right. Okay. Hell yeah! Free healing. Free healing items. Um, okay, we'll have to tidy this up a bit, though. Uh, right, we'll move that down here. 
Uh, I'll move the shotgun shells over. Um, these should go down here, really, with the rifle. Swap these around. Um, I'll put these fish up here. Uh, can I fit that big one in here now? Probably not, right? Dang. Ah. Can I just use it? Hold on. Oh, I'm full health. Doesn't matter. Right, I'll take the little one then. It's still better than nothing. There we go. And uh, you all go under here. There we are. Cool. Oh, there's loads of them. <gasps> oh, yeah, I'll take that. And I'll take another fish. Okay. What's this? <gasps> Handgun! That's exactly what I needed. Exactly what I needed. Oh, I know the bit with the creepy clown model. Yeah, that's the one. Uh, you're on the tail end of the better half of seven, in my opinion. But it is worth seeing till the end. I haven't played any of the DLC either. I haven't played any of the DLC. Um, I know Chris uh, Chris Redfield's involved in the DLC in that one, isn't he? I know because um, um, it does uh, kind of uh, explain. It kind of recaps uh, number number seven at the beginning and number eight. So I I know pretty much what happens in it, more or less. Um, I'm really, I'm really running low on a handgun ammo here. Oh, I'm going to, I'm going to say that more often because it seems as though whenever I say I need handgun ammo, the game gives me handgun ammo, which is nice. Can I, uh, can I lure these guys down into this trap? No, there's no guys there. Okay. And I can knife this. There we go. Okay, cool. We're almost at the end of this chapter, in fact. Which is nice. Uh, uh. Cool. I won't spoil it, but it's uh, the last one they made. The others are pretty fun too. Oh, one of the DLCs is fucking brilliant. Okay. It's one of the last ones they made. Is it, um, is it the Chris one? There's one, um, I got them all, so th I think there was one that was like, uh, Jack's birthday party, which is kind of weird. But I bet you that's interesting at the same time. It sounds interesting. God, I really want to play that game now. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm going to play it. I'm going to play it at some point this year, in fact. I've got plans to, anyway. It's, um, technically, it's technically, uh, one of the first games I tried to stream. But um, it went kind of wrong. <laughs> it went kind of hello wrong. Um, but yeah, it, it was back uh, when I was just, just, just starting. And I didn't really know what I was doing. So uh, I might do that. Um, I might do that at some point. At some point. Watch this space. Watch this space. It's the one after the Chris one. It's called, oh, End of Zoe. Yeah, yeah. I know the one. Well, I don't. I just know the name. I don't know because I haven't played it, but I know what you mean. That would be sick. How long you been streaming? I, uh, I think I officially, I officially started on Halloween last year. And I started by, um, I, I had two attempts prior to that, but they didn't really go very well. Um, but my first, like, proper successful stream, I think, was uh, Halloween last year. And it was um, starting uh, Village, Resident Evil 8 Village, incidentally. That was the first game. I'd had one uh, attempt to try streaming Dark Souls prior to that, and one attempt uh, uh, Resident Evil 7, but the Resident Evil 7 stream went completely wrong. Um, it went completely wrong. And then, um, yeah, Resident Evil 8 on Halloween was, was technically my first stream, I think. So not long, not long. It's been less than a year. Uh, right, let's save the game. Hell yeah, save the game. But yeah, I got it, um, one day I'll definitely beat, uh, seven. And I'll play through all the DLCs as well. 
Leon, I've been able to get some new info that might help you. Fill me in. Apparently, Craig David there's me. a religious cult group involved. They're called the Los Illuminados. Los Illuminados? <laughs> That's a mouthful. Anyway, I had an unexpected run-in with the big cheese of this village. But you're okay, right? Yeah. But he could have killed me, but he let me live. And he mentioned something about me carrying the same blood as them. Whatever that means. Oh, have I been infected already? Blood. Oh, yeah, I remember. It happens when um, anyway, they're more you and uh, Lewis are uh, captured together, right? I remember. You're right. Hurry and find that church, Leon. Do you know what? Um, I hope they don't go down that route in the remake. I hope they don't infect Leon. Um, yeah, I hope they leave that out. In all honesty. Um, oh my god, this is such a mess. Uh, I guess I got no choice. I got no choice because I got no room for things. I can put these. Uh, I can put these back down here. Out of the way. And what I could do, I guess. No, that'll have to do. That'll have to do. God, I, that kills me though. Um, I showed this off last time. But um, there's a little secret by here. Um, I guess uh, you, what you're supposed to do is just move on. But uh, if you go back in this door... I know I showed this last time, but I'll show it again. Oh, I forgot about that. I forgot about that. She's got a different costume too. If you change your costume, it changes uh, Ada's costume. That's cool. I love this secret. It's so spooky. <laughs> yeah. The thing is though, I noticed this last time as well. In that cutscene, he um, fires his gun and it hits the Sadler picture in between the eyes. But none of them have got a bullet hole in it. I know that's that's a bit nitpicky, but still, you know, attention to detail, like. Oh, I wonder if um, I wonder if Ashley's got the suit of armor on. I that might be costume two though. That's really handy as well. All right, let's go and kill this guy. Let's get him out of the way. Oh shit! Never mind, he got me. Who right. said that? Cheers, physio. <laughs> Thanks, dude. I missed. A whiff to win my knife. Shambles. Uh, fortunately, I think this is guaranteed. I think there's a guaranteed chicken egg in here. Yeah, there is. Uh, yeah, I will take that, but I'm going to use the fish. There we go. Cool. We're, uh, we're loaded up on healing items, thankfully. Granted, it's mainly fish, but still. I'll take it on a uh, pro professional, you know? Yeah, well that, that is a pretty cool secret, though. Right, okay, here we go. Here we go. Oh, God, I hate these guys. This is the first one we've run across on this occasion. Try again. How much does... Oh, Crow, How? Crow Brew, you're a streamer too. This, this wall is a wall. How much does the wall... Thanks for, uh, thanks for taking care of the SO as well, Physio. Thanks for that. I'll, uh, I'll, have, to, uh, I'll have to follow you back uh, after the stream, Crow Brew. It's the least I can do, I guess. Right. Um, <laughs> look at that guy's face! <laughs> anyway, right. Um, I'm going to take him out first. Just to get rid of him. I got them both. That was pretty that was pretty lucky. Halt! I'm a cop. Okay. Right, reload properly. I don't want to be caught out with this guy. This guy can insta kill you. We keep him back. If he gets too close though, I just switch to the shotgun. That'll do the job. I really want those bullets before they disappear as well. Maybe I should be shooting this guy in the head.
Are they disappearing? Please don't disappear. I need those bullets. Is he done? Nope, he's not done. That's weird. Okay. The music didn't didn't Oh All my right, no, god. Take out your aggression on this last one. It's time to punch the English and punch the English and punch the English and punch the English and punch Luckily the I can pause. Punch the English and punch the English and punch the English and punch him in their stupid face and breathe. Luckily I can pause physio. Well done, Thought you got me. Good workout. But I can pause this game. I did panic for a little bit then, though. I forgot I could pause the game. <laughs> you kidding me? That guy would cut my head straight off. He would cut my straight off. I'm from, you're from Wales as well, Crowbrew. Oh, nice. Nice. Always, uh, always good to um, meet a Welsh brother. Do you think she'll let me do it right now? I, I, I keep wanting to kind of try it. But I don't know. Oh, oh my gosh, Gemma! Oh, no, she doesn't like it though. <laughs> that wasn't the, uh. That wasn't the, uh. No, it wasn't the fit, uh. The, the, fight, the little dinosaur fighting, right? Out the egg. I kind of missed that. I kind of missed the clip. I'm sorry. Get down on the ground. I'm a cop. Oh, hang on. Oh yeah. I think um I think those bullets disappeared in the end, right? Unfortunately. Anyone in there? Ma'am, come out with your hands up. I'm a cop. Put down your weapon. Cool. <laughs> that clip is so cute. <laughs> I kind of missed it. I'm not, I'm I'm sad now. I'm sad. Never mind. Um, this one, I think, has just got TMP ammo in. I don't know whether to get the TMP this time around. I mean, last time I wouldn't touch it, but... I don't know if it would be useful on this difficulty. All of you get down on the ground. I'm a cop. I will use lethal force. Oh, okay, cool. I'll take that. Whoa! I was lucky. Uh, I never liked the TMP much, but you do get lots of rounds. Yeah, same. Um, last time we played through it, last time we played through it, I wouldn't even touch it. Um, I don't normally, I guess, but... Um, don't, I don't know whether to take it or not um, on professional. I don't know whether it'd be useful. It might be because um, I'm going to have to really be um, reserved with my uh, my powerful ammo in this instance. Uh, like, for example, I'm going to have to save like pretty much all my magnum ammo for Krauser. Um, that's just a given. So, uh, I don't know, it could be useful. It could be useful just for some extra uh, firepower. Um, I don't really want to go spraying too many shotgun rounds either, but... They're in a big group. Okay. Okay, I think we're... Uh... He's stuck there, the little shit.
Get out of here. Sir? Sir, stop or I'll shoot. I'm a cop. Oh. I keep mistaking that one for one where you can m hit them. The one where they hold their knee. Oh, there's an egg. Go grab that egg before it disappears. Could be a lucky egg. Could be a luck buff. Give me that luck buff. Yes. All right. I see that guy on the roof as well. Don't you? They, they all wearing straw hats. You ain't Luffy. Take that straw hat off. Who do you think you are? Um, yeah, the TMP sucks, but can be useful on pro. It's useful for grunts to take them to the floor. The knife is super powerful against Krauser. I saw, um, I saw something on Twitter um, the other day, incidentally. Um, now that you bring up Krauser and the knife. Um, they posted a clip up on Twitter, and um, they were like, I forgot how much of a pushover Krauser is on professional with the knife strap. And they're just knifing them over and over and over. <clears throat> and he can't do anything. He's like pretty much stunlocked. He can't even, uh, he can't even do anything. He can't attack or anything. And they just keep doing it until he dies. It was really cool. If I can, um, if I can get something like that to work this time around. <clears throat> excuse me, sorry. Um, if I can get something like that to work this time around, that would be amazing. Because, um, I remember Krauser on Professional just being an absolute nightmare. He was a nightmare. I literally had to save every single piece of Magnum ammo that I could for that moment. Um, where are we going? I think we go, um, I think we go through this door now, right? This door up ahead. Um, ain't my going merry. <laughs> uh, I think I saw the same clip. Yeah, it was on, um, it was on Twitter. I saw it. And it gives me hope, if anything, because uh, the thought of fighting Krauser legit is just, oh my god, it's terrifying. Speaking of TMP, oh, I think there's a treasure in this. Don't cook me. There is. Cool. Hang on. Um, oh no, he's not there, is he? He's downstairs. I remember. Uh, I noticed your straw hat in the distance there too. I got one myself too. I got uh, big into One Piece when I was in college. Um, I've been into One Piece now. Uh, it's, it's fairly recent um, considering how old I am. Um, within the last, say, seven years, probably about se seven, eight years ago, I got into One Piece. And um, at the time, I didn't, I didn't realize how, actual, how long it was. Um, but I started buying the DVDs and uh, the DVD collections and I just got hooked. I just got hooked from there. Um, I've got, um, I'm, I would show you, but they're massive. Um, I got like three, uh, three of the collections of the books behind me as well. And they're in, um, proper chests as well. Uh, I say chests. They're like, um, they're just like nice boxes. Um, I call them chests, so. Um, I've got the fourth collection on order, but um, I don't know when that's arriving. Amazon are just like, oh, uh, it's not been dispatched yet. It was meant to come in May. Uh, but yeah, it seems as though it's been delayed or something. I don't know. I'll just have to wait for it. Um, I'm not up to date, though. I'm not up to date. Um, I'm furthest in the anime, but I'm not up to date. Um, where I am at the moment, Luffy is going to Whole Cake Island to save Sanji. Um, they've just been um, on Zhao Island, and uh, Luffy's on his way to go and pick up Sanji, uh, or go and get him back from Big Mama. Um, so he's on his way to Whole Cake Island. I really have to get up to date, though, because um, it's so hard to avoid anything. And not only that, I don't want to, I, I look at everything, I look at everything that's going on right now, and so much good stuff's going on right now, so I need to get up to date as soon as I can, because it's all going off for the minute, and I love it, and I, I, I just want to get up to date, 
Uh, I really want to get up to date because it's, it's so what good at the moment. It. All sorts is happening. But uh, yeah, One Piece is sick. Is I love One Piece. <laughs> it's really good. Thank you. Um, <laughs> Physio, I want to watch One Piece, but it's so long. Yeah, <laughs> it is so long, but it's so worth it at the same time. It really is. It's so worth it. Um, dope. I started buying the man uh, manga, got up till just after the time skip, then stopped. It's such a good, uh, great shonen. I heard the most recent arc, Wano or something, is supposed to be insane. Yeah, it is insane, dude. It is insane. Um, it's all going on. It's all going on. All Lately as well. I mean, I started to um, I started to really like this character in Thriller Bark at the end of Thriller Bark because he's so badass. But I'm I'm becoming such a Zoro main, uh, a Zoro stan. Zoro is fucking awesome. He's so badass. He's so badass. Um, that bit in uh, after Thriller Bark when he's taking all that of Luffy's pain, and they find him, and he's and Sanji's like, "What the hell happened?" He's like nothing <laughs> and he's all fucked up i was uh, that blew me away that moment <laughs> it was you. fucking uh, awesome <laughs> thank you. zoro so cool thank dude you. Uh, but um thank you i love um i love brook as well brook is hilarious what are you buying right i need this give me all? that <laughs> thank you thank what are you buying um i thank also you. want I think I'm going to do some updates. Oh yeah, Salmon. What's up, Salmon? How we doing, buddy? Happy Big Tuesday. Um, it's going very well, Salmon. Thank you very much for asking, dude. I hope you're well as well. Hope you've had a good day. Hope you've had a good day and a good week so far, Salmon. How are we doing? Uh, dude, that bit is so good. Yeah, it is, Crowbrew. It is. It blew me away when I first saw it. I really like... Um, I don't think um, I don't think it's pop this is um, a popular opinion, but I really like Thriller Bark. Thriller Bark is one of my favorite arcs. It's really good. I really enjoyed it. Dude, when these, um, when the, um, the first three go through, like the weaker three, and they're like uh, getting scared by all the zombies and everything and running around, and then you see like uh, the stronger ones r roll through with like Luffy, and the zombie picks, uh, pokes his head up and he just go, he just walks up to him and pushes him back into the ground. It's hilarious. Hilarious. And he's like, this old guy's really injured. He's going to die. And uh, they end up chasing away the Cerberus instead of getting chased. Oh, it's so funny. The contrast between the two. It's, it's hilarious. Uh, Salmon, thanks for the yes. Oh, no problem, dude. No problem. Thanks for uh, picking those up, Physio. You've been on top of those lately. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, dude. Um, do we want to upgrade anything right now? Because I'm not going to be sticking with these guns, right? Would it be worth waiting until uh, I pick up guns that I'm going to be using for the majority of the game. I can't remember what we did last time. I think we upgraded them until we sold them. They're obviously, it obviously increases their value, right, if you upgrade them. That's what I'm assuming, anyway. How are my uh, ammo? I know my shotgun and my rifle are full right now. I suppose I could top up my uh, handgun's Welcome. capacity. That'd be worthwhile. Because I'm on seven bullets buying? at the minute. What are you Let's buying? Just double check this list. I don't want the TMP. What are you I decided buying? I'm not going to touch the TMP. Screw the TMP. Um, maybe... Maybe capacity and firepower. Reload speed might be uh, worthwhile as well. So I've been caught out with my reloads a couple of times. I tell you what, I'm just going to go for firepower. <laughs> Thank you. That'll be useful. Come and we'll save the rest of the money. Um, how goes professional? Um, so far, so good, Salmon. Um, I had a rough start. I had a rough start. I died like four times in the beginning area. But since then... Since then, we've uh, not died, and we're in good shape. Uh, Crowbrew. Luffy is great at, <laughs> at building super strong friendships. Uh, they crew is so good. Uh, Mecha is making it look like easy mode from what I've seen. Oh, thanks, Crowbrew. You're being, you're being kind, though. You're being kind. Uh, you wouldn't say that if you saw the stat. No. I got murked, like, immediately. Like, four times. 
four times in a row. It was uh, it was it wasn't pretty. It wasn't pretty. I know there's a um, I know there's a bird's nest in this area. Ah, there it is. I see it. Yeah, it was not pretty. <laughs> we learn through pain. <laughs> Wise words, Crowbrew. Wise words. Um, right. Oh, there's uh, medallions here as well. I forgot about that. I forgot about the medallions. If I get... I don't know how many I've got. If I can get ten, could I just go back to um, Merchant Boy and just go and pick it up? I guess so, right? Right, I'm going to use the rifle here. Might be a bit of a waste, but still. It might make life easier as well. I want that before it disappears. Uh oh. That might have been a mistake. Oop, no, we're good. Okay. Okay, okay. I want this. This is precious to me. Cool, we got it. Um, where are they coming from? I want to say down here. Sounds like they're behind me. Aha! Oh, that was terrible. Get on the ground. I'm a cop. Okay. Not good. It could have been worse, though. It could have been worse. I have got eggs, so it's fine. Um, from what I've heard, professional is rough. It is, Salmon. It's not... Um, it's no uh, walk in the park. Um, it's been a long time since I've played professional. Um, it, was probably, um, it was probably back on the GameCube was the last time I beat professional. Um, back in uh, 2005. But um, from what I remember, it's, uh, it's rough. It is. It's no, uh, it's no walk in the park. Certainly not. You have to... Um we, we were talking about this actually um, earlier. They might be legitimate cheeses to uh, a really difficult boss that we've been talking about and if there is I'm gonna be so happy if I can get it to work but um, otherwise you have to like you basically have to do things like save all your most powerful ammo um, for, for like certain bosses just to be able to get past them it is uh, it is quite tough there's some bits that is just like it is just tr trial and error there's no there's no no avoiding it You have to like do things like this strat, where you have to knife them on the floor to save bullets. It's uh, it's a whole different ball game on professional. It really is. Right, I want that medallion. I haven't been keeping track. I gotta make note of what number this one is. Ready? Let's see one number. Hang on. Okay. I think there's another one here as well. I'm pretty sure there's another one here. If I remember. Oh, there we go. We got enough. I don't need to bother. Um, last time we played, I got all 15. I'm not going to bother this time because it's just another uh, five bullets. So uh, there's no point. You only need 10 or more. Um, last time I did get them all, but I'm not going to bother, bother this time. Uh, <laughs> that dynamite shot. I've had quite a few good dynamite shots this uh, today, in all fairness, uh, Crowbrew. Welcome. Even if I do say so myself, I've had some really good shots some on the dynamite. On right, give me my gun. What are you buying? I'll take that off your hands. Um, oh shit, I don't have room. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. We can sort this out. Uh, be neat. Uh, this will have to go under the fish. There we go. Perfect. Just about fits. <laughs> now, sell it to him this? immediately. That's another 10k. Sweet. Ah. <laughs> Thank you. Awesome. Come back nice doing business with you, my good man. Hey, Morgan. Hey. Uh, happy Big Tuesday, Morgan. How are we doing? I hope you're doing good. Uh, America, I'm here but lurking for a... Uh, while uh, I hop in the shower. No problem. Thanks for the lurk. Thanks for the lurk. And thanks for being here. Uh, you rounding out achievements or just for fun? 
Um, kind of a bit of both, Salmon. Um, kind of a bit of both. Um, there was a few factors, actually, as to why I, I decided to play this. Um, initially, um, when, I was, uh, when I finished playing my first um, run through this, uh, I was going to uninstall it to make space on my Okay, but this with the big on my nose. PC. Hold on. Let's go back. Oh, my God. Hold on. What have you done to that poor creator character, Morgan? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> she looks like she's made out of putty. Um, but yeah, when I, I was coming to uninstall it, and I was looking on Steam, and I noticed that um, Professional was the only achievement that I didn't get from that first run through. So I was like, oh, let's do that. Let's, um, let's go through it again. So I kept it installed on my machine. But then, um, of course, the uh, Resident Evil 4 remake trailer dropped uh, last week. So I was like, all right, I, I, it's, it's time to jump on the Resident Evil 4 again, basically. Right, so we got Z. Um, I think it's like a M shape, if I remember. Yeah, there we go, M. And a V, there we go. All right. Is it four or three? Hold on, what's this? So it's uh, ZM... V, ZMV, and now that's Elden Lord right there. <laughs> uh -huh. She definitely looked like it was she was made out of putty, that character. Wow. Get out of the way, I need to... Oh. I've, uh, I've jinx definitely jinxed myself there, haven't I? I'm going to use um, this mixed herb now. Uh, we'll level up our, our health. May as well. It'll fully heal us and increase our max health. So, makes sense. Damn. Yeah, that was because I was uh, saying oh, I've, I've, I've had some really good shots on the dynamite. Right. Uh, ZMV, wasn't it? Uh, I think we go... I think we go four. Uh, three... Three, four. Ah, uh, no. I don't think that was right. Three again. Oops. Hmm. There we go. I'm a puzzle god. Um, while I'm here, actually, before I forget. Also, last time, I'm pretty sure I missed one of these cat eyes. I'm pretty sure I did. Hold on, let me take a look at the map real quick. Wrong button. Have I missed any treasures, treasures so far? No. Good. Okay. Oh. No, okay, that's not right. Okay, cool. We haven't missed any yet. <laughs> Elden Lord. Um, did I miss any of the chat? Leon, have you reached the church yet? Uh, well, yeah. I think I'm up to date, sort of. I think I'm up to date. Leon, did I mention not to take the scenic route? At any rate, Ashley's probably inside that structure. Rescue her. Hurry. All right, calm down. I wonder what Hunnigan's going to be like in the remake. I wonder if Hunnigan's even going to be in the remake. Thinking about it. She might not even be in there. It makes sense for her not to be. Get out of here. Whoa, that was close. Get off my bridge. Oh, I didn't fall off. You can, though. Fuck off. Get out of here. I'm a cop. Whoa. He drops him in. Hold up. Take his wallet. Don't forget to take his wallet. I'm a cop. I'm allowed to take his wallet. Uh, I think this one's guaranteed to be a snake. Yeah. Okay, cool. Cool, I got an egg for that as well, which is good. Um, also, I'm not going to read through all the notes this time. We'll watch the cutscenes. 
Um, but I'm not going to read the notes. I can't. I, you know what I'm like I, with reading. I, I, I don't like reading. I don't like reading out loud anyway. So, uh, sorry, but I'm not going to read the notes. I got a knife. Uh, gonna have to bounce now to get some food. It's been a pleasure to meet you, man. Really enjoy hanging out. Catch you soon. You too, back at you, Crow Brew. Um, it's nice to meet you too. And uh, thanks for the follow. And uh, make sure you eat something delicious, dude. Eat something really good. And uh, take care, buddy. Uh, thanks, for, thanks for hanging out with us. Thanks for hanging out with us today. Um, Salmon, aren't they altering the story some? I believe so. Um, that is word on the street, um, is that they're going to be making it more grounded and more um, more horror um, more horror focused. Because this one's a little cheesy. Uh, this one's a little bit cheesy and over the top, which is fine. That's part of its charm, and that's what people like about it. But um, I was saying, uh, even before the trailer dropped, I was like, I really hope um, that they take out some of the like silly over the top action there's literally some parts where like you'll um you'll have a qte where you're like sprinting and you just like literally jump a hundred foot grab a ledge and it, it's all this nonsense i want them to really ground it down uh, that's that's exactly what i wanted personally i wanted i wanted them to ground it down and uh you know make it a, a, take away a bit of the the cheesiness um also um i want them to um i want them to explain things better I want them to explain, um, spoilers, but I want them to go into depth of what uh, Ada is actually doing, uh, why, she's, um, why she's working with uh, whoever, she, uh, I think it's Wesker. If, uh, right, I don't know if this will work, but I've only got flashbangs, so hopefully this will work. It did, fantastic. Okay, cool. I wasn't sure if flashbangs would kill them, but uh, it did. Uh, yeah, I also I want them to explain more. Basically, I want them to explain uh, if Krause is going to be in it again. I want the I want like his uh, history with Leon to be like uh, explained better because uh, they they're meant to have history together. They're meant to have worked together in some capacity in the past. Um, I want uh, I want a, more of an explanation as to what Ada's up to. You know, um, I think she I we missed this right, but I pretty sure that there's a stinger at the end of the game where um, she's picking up the uh, Las Plagas sample for Wesker. Um, or maybe that was in, uh, maybe that was in the separate ways. Um, and we know she is working for Wesker as well because uh, uh, a conversation she has with, uh, with Krauser at points of the game. But uh, I wanted to elaborate on stuff more, you know, and uh, make more sense of why uh, people uh, are, are doing these things. That's, that's what I want. And it, for it to be less cheesy. Um, ooh, I'm down for more horror. Um, apparently as well, apparently Shin, uh, what's his name? Oh, God. I can't, be uh, this, I can't believe I'm drawing a blank on his name. The guy who made this game. The guy who created um, um, Resident Evil. Um, Shinji Mikami. Um, he, um, he wanted to make it more horror. Um, to begin with, but he thinks he missed the mark with it. Uh, apparently, anyway, that's what I heard. Do you know what I also heard as well? He, um, and Goop, if, if you're listening, Goop, you know Goof Troop, the game? I found out the other day that he made that. He Not directed rare that. Things on sale, stranger. Uh, the Super Nintendo version. The guy who uh, created, um, uh, who created, um, Resident Evil. Is that all he also made uh, the Goof Troop game and the Aladdin game as well, which is crazy. Shinji Mikami. Um, what are you buying? What can we get? What are you buying? Um, oh, I what think I think we need to start powering up these guns. To be fair, um, I'm gonna get. Hang on, my guns are full now, right? Yeah, I'm not gonna get uh, ammo capacity then. What are you buying? Let's get reload speed, definitely, definitely, because I've been caught out a few times reloading. 
Let's go there. <laughs> Thank you. Hmm. I'm gonna get the shotgun firepower Is that all? <laughs> and uh, rifle firepower. Is that, all? <laughs> that makes sense Thank to me. You. And uh, a bit Is of firing speed on this as well. <laughs> Thank you. But no capacity because uh, I'm gonna try and I'm gonna try and uh, save that for um, when we're when we've got no bullets in the clip, just so we get a free reload, just to be uh, as efficient as we possibly can. <laughs> Uh, what? <laughs> the duality of man. What are you buying? <laughs> I love the merchant, man. I hope the merchant comes back. I hope they, um, if they can as well, if they can, I hope they use the same voice actor for the merchant. The merchant's the best. I want to know what his deal is, though. I mean, he doesn't, like, does he escape? And also, I swear his eyes change towards the end of the game and they go more yellow as if he's, like, infected. I have no idea. See, that's another thing that doesn't go explained. They do. They do not explain the uh, the merchant in the slightest. It's just an anomaly, an enigma, rather. Who said that? Yes, physio. Pizza. How are you liking the pizza? Better than the flour pizza I had last time. You got pizza, salmon? Dude, whenever <laughs> whenever I'm like I'm like talking to you in your chat or <laughs> like now, like right now, pizza always comes up. <laughs> I don't know what it is. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but it I it always uh it always comes back to pizza, dude. Which isn't a bad thing, but <laughs> I don't know. It's just uh, a coincidence, I guess. Right, see if I can get this guy to walk into the trap like a dumbass. Oh, so he just walks up the stairs. All right, I'm the dumbass. I didn't know that there was like a, a way up right next to where he was standing. Two for one. Nice. My, my knife is almighty and slays all. Right, okay. See if I can uh, pull this off. Yes, it worked. Awesome. Okay. Cool. I've just noticed something up there that I've missed. Um... Don't get, make sure I don't get blown up. Uh, I didn't have any food, so I ran and stole some pizza from my brother. <laughs> it's one of my favorite foods, so versatile. Pizza is so versatile and so good. Yep, I agree. I agree 100%. Uh, Pep in Hawaii? Ooh. Pineapple should not be on pizza. Physio is 100% right. Pineapple does not belong on pizza. Would you put apple on your pizza? Huh? Would you, would you put, would you put like, would you put pears on your pizza? Or a segment of orange? Do you know what I mean? It's weird. Why would you put, why would you put pineapple on your pizza? It's, it's just, it's, it doesn't work. It's disgusting. I don't like the Hawaiian pizza, yuck, but Joe loves it. Joe ate pineapple and ham and crushed red pe- Oh my god, disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. You may as well put, like, a slice of apple on your pizza. Or a grape. You know what I mean? You wouldn't do that though, would you? You wouldn't put grapes on your pizza. Wouldn't put, like, you wouldn't, like, peel an orange, separate all the segments, and just put a segment of orange on your each slice of pizza? No. So why would you why would you put pineapple on there? It's minging. Absolutely gross. But uh, I don't know. I don't know. We're not here to king shame, so you know, you uh, you put what you want on your pizza, I guess. Oh, that's a snake. Can I knife him? 
I can't even see him. He's underwater. Damn it. I won the egg off that snake then. Oh, I got him. I found him. Right. Where's that snake gone? <laughs> Italians everywhere are crying. I agree. Fruit doesn't belong on pizza 100%. The only fruit that does belong on pizza is tomato. That's the only acceptable fruit. Because that's not really, that doesn't really taste like a fruit. It tastes more like a vegetable anyway. You know? Um, I'm here to pizza shame. <laughs> At least it's not banana pizza. Exactly. It's just as bad. It's just as bad. In my opinion, putting pineapple on your pizza is just as bad as putting banana on your pizza. Or something equally as disgusting. You know? Just put a fruit salad on your pizza. Why not, innit? Awful. Awful behaviour. Olives are so good. I Now, that I can get on board with. Olives are the best. I'm a little bit too obsessed with olives, though. Like, um, every time I open up, um, like, uh, a pack of olives to, to put all over my pizza, I'll just start eating them, and I'll be there for like quite some time. And I could easily just like eat, eat the whole thing in one go. I can't stop. They're so addictive. Especially green ones. Green ones are the best ones. Whoa, that was close. There's a lot of guys here right now. There's a lot of guys here right now. I think it's shotgun time. Get back. I'm a cop. Oh shit. I don't think these guys care. Can you not tell I'm a cop? What's wrong with these guys? You resisting arrest? Roundhouse. How are these guys still alive as well? They've taken like... They've taken so many shotgun rounds. There we go. All good, all good. Uh, olives do be good on pizza though. Olives are just great. Olives are so good. I love olives. I've got a little bit too much of an obsession with olives, I think. The wildest I'll go is like spinach and macaroni and cheese. Macaroni and cheese on pizza, interesting. And mushrooms on pizza, not at the same time, obvs. Uh, on board with spinach, on board with olives, on board with mushrooms, uh, peppers, mixed peppers, bell peppers, of course, um, red onions, um, we said spinach, right? Um, sweet corn, uh, I like to put falafel on uh, uh, pizza as well. That's pretty cool. Oh, shit. I just broke that egg. I didn't even know you could do that. Did you see that? I broke the egg. I didn't know that I... Wasn't sure if the snake was dead or not. So I swiped again and I actually broke the egg. I didn't even know that was possible. Interesting. Where else is good on pizza? If I still ate meat, I would totally be on uh, pepperoni. Pepperoni on pizza is just the one. Get back. I'm a cop. Oh shit, oh bad reload. Oh god, right, eat the fish, eat the fish, eat the fish. Wow, they're really good healing items as well. I'm using so much shotgun ammo though, it's unreal. Damn it! Bastard. Sir, stay on the ground. Stay on the ground, sir. I'm a cop. It's 
spinach is really good too. Yeah, spinach is really good. I used to um, I used to think my housemate was weird because he would buy a bag of spinach leaves, and he would just sit there, open them, and he would just eat them. He would just eat eat these spinach leaves straight out of the bag. But that was before I knew I, I knew how good that was. You know, eating spinach leaves is just amazing. You wouldn't think so, right? You wouldn't think uh, leaves could be delicious, but I don't know. There's something about just eating spinach. It's real good for you as well. Real good for you. You know that Popeye? He was onto something. Although, um, let's not get started with Popeye. Popeye, I blame uh, for a lot of... Uh, I, I think Popeye was a real bad influence on me growing up. You know, eating spinach through a pipe and all that. Fuck you, snake. What? You, that missed? It was all subliminal messages. If you ask me. Not that I'm suggesting anything, of course. <laughs> okay, I'm not crazy. I still need something with spinach. I need it in like a salad or in some pasta sauce it can be good i do that with carrots oh dude carrots i think i prefer carrots raw honestly i think i do Ooh, there's loads of snakes everywhere how about you snake um dude if i um i could just like peel all the like outside off of a carrot you know all the like skin and all the dirty bit uh cut the ends off and just just chew on it man um Raw carrot is... I think I prefer carrot raw to cooked. I love um, cooked carrots, don't get me wrong. But raw carrot is just the best. It's so good. It's so good, dude. Especially if you get, like... Uh, you chop it into sticks. And then you get, like, a tub of hummus. And you, uh, you dip the sticks in hummus. Oh, dude. That's so good. Right, watch these guys now. Come at me, bro. <laughs> Dumbass. <laughs> Oh, he's over there. I couldn't see him. Uh, in cooked veg are most nutritions. I, um, I don't know though. I just love the taste of raw carrot. What happened? Someone blew up. I heard someone blow up. They must have run into a trap, but I didn't think there was any traps left. They're really hard to spot in the water as well. Oh, it must have been this. This guy must have blown up somehow. Oh, I'll take handgun ammo. Hell yeah. Mecca, have you tried dark chocolate hummus? Dark chocolate hummus? Are you? That sounds awful. That sounds absolutely disgusting. I don't think, I, I've never even heard of that or seen it. That sounds really weird. What was it, um, what was the weird ice cream flavors that you were on about before when I was in your chat? When, um, I think it was when you and Joe were playing Star Wars Lego, uh, the Skywalker Saga one, the, when, it was, when it was like brand new. You were talking about, I think it was ice cream. And I was like, only in America, only in America would you have that flavor of ice cream. It was really, really odd though. It's really, really odd. It's so good. It's made with cocoa mixed in. You eat it with the naan bread. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, the nasty pizza and macaroni and cheese flavor. Yeah, pizza flavor ice cream and macaroni and cheese flavor ice cream. And you were talking about that and I was just like, that would only happen in America. <laughs> it's when you have pizza flavored ice cream. That is like the weirdest thing ever. <laughs> I bought them both and they are both awful. To be fair, nobody asked for that. <laughs> I didn't ask for this. I'm out of here. Have a good night all. You too, Physio. Um, have a good one, bro. Thanks for hanging out um, tonight. And uh, thanks for uh, picking up a lot of the SOs tonight as well, dude. I'll, uh, I'll catch up with you next time. You take care. Right. I think we're near the end of the chapter now. And I've also noticed 
that I haven't had a break yet. I've been doing that a lot lately. I've been getting carried away with the games I've been playing. But um, yeah, after this chapter, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna take a quick break because uh, my legs are starting to feel it as well. Get you some stretches in. We'll do. I'll be doing my diamond cutters. Don't worry, Morgan. Get my diamond cutters in. Got to uh, make sure I keep up this physique. <laughs> I'm told. Um, I should probably explain that I'm being sarcastic because I'm told that I can't do sarcasm, which is really weird because I'm British. But I cannot do sarcasm. It's got me in trouble in the past as well. You know, I've tried to be sarcastic and people take me as being literal and they, they're not happy. And I'm like, whoa, I'm chill. I'm being sarcastic, but I can't do it. I can't do it. Like I say, it's really odd because I'm British. British, are like, British people are meant to be like the kings of sarcasm, right? But I just can't do it. <coughs> oh, hell yeah, I'll take that. I don't think I've... <gasps> I have... Right, I've got a foot. Look at this mess as well. This is killing me. I can't, I cannot handle this mess. It's just awful. Ugh. I gotta be neat. My attache case has got, always gotta be neat. And uh, that, the sight of that is killing me. It's absolutely killing me. I'm not gonna do this this time either though, but I'll just mention it again. Um, I don't need to. You get an achievement for it. This is a boss fight here. But um, if you shoot the water, um, you shoot the water a couple of times here, and he'll jump out, and he'll eat you, and insta-kill you. It's like a little easter egg, and you get an achievement for it. I showed it off last time, but I'm not going to do it now. There's no need to. Um, yes. Okay, I do have room for that. Okay, fantastic. Uh, okay, cool, cool, cool. Alright, cool. It's actually the end of the chapter after the boss fight. So, um, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to take a quick break before uh, the boss fight actually um, as my legs are, are starting to really feel it oh that didn't fully heal that's fine I'll use two should have used a brown one but never mind okay all right let's go and uh, let's go and rest in this cabin I don't know if you guys can hear the seagulls behind me as well they've been uh, they've been they've been going off today they've been going off um, it's the British comedy that's very dry. They better keep that in the new one. Oh, the, um, the Easter egg with the, I, it depends, dude. They might not even keep this boss in the, in the, the next game. I'd imagine, I'd imagine they'd have, uh, still have El Gigante because, um, one of them shows up in number eight. I missed that. I completely missed that. I didn't know about it until, um, my housemate told me about it. Um, cause there was one treasure I couldn't get and it's the one in the grave outside the dollhouse place and uh, you're supposed to fight an El Gigante out there and um, he's the only one in the game um, so it's nice that they put so I guarantee El Gigante will be in uh, the remake because uh, they had one in, in Resident Evil 8 um, but yeah I, I don't know I don't know if they'll keep every boss the same we know that um, Rasputin looking guy with the two different color eyes um, from that cutscene we've seen him in there we've seen him like his silhouette standing there all hench uh, obviously Sadler. There was no Salazar. We didn't see Salazar in the uh, new um, in the new um, trailer. Actually, didn't see Salazar at all. Uh, I should get around to playing Village sometime. It's good. It's good. It, it overstays its welcome, in my opinion, though. Um, there's a part. Um, there's a part where it would have been better to end, but there's like another hour or two after that, and it's um, it's unnecessary, if you ask me. It, it's it's a little bit too long. Um, it outstays its welcome. But it's still a good game, though. It's still a good game. It's got mad Resident Evil 4 vibes. Um, it, it The location and a few other things about it total, uh, totally gave me Resi 4 vibes. I got Resi 4 vibes um, even from the initial reveal trailer when they uh, revealed it. It is a good game, though. It is a good game. Uh, Village is good, but definitely kind of long. Yeah. It's, I won't say anything because I don't want to spoil it, but there's, um, it could have ended after one particular boss 
and it would have been fine. That would have been a good length. Um, but I won't, I won't spoil it. Uh, but anyway, right. Um, if you bear with me, gang, um, I'm not going to be uh, too long. I'll be the usual five minutes, but no longer than seven, okay? And uh, bear with me. I'll, uh, I'll be, I'll be. Thank <laughs> you.